Hey, what's up guys? I'm on R2, and today I'm going to be showing you guys what render settings I use in Adobe After Effects. So let's get started. In this tutorial, I'm going to be using this V9 intro as the example. And if you want to see how these render settings look, you can check out the V9 intro on my channel or any of my recent intros. Alright, so first thing we're going to do, we're going to go to Composition, and we're going to do Add to Render Queue. And now we've just added this video uh, to the render queue, obviously. So we're going to start out by clicking on Best Settings next to Render Settings. And it should automatically be on the right settings, but in case it isn't, you're going to want the quality at best. You're going to want the resolution at full. And you're going to make sure that your size matches the size of um, your intro. So for me, it's 1920 by 1080, but I know for a lot of you guys, it will be 1280 by 720. All right, so I'm going to click OK for that. And now next to Output Module, we're going to click on Lossless. And this is where we're going to be doing most of the changes. So um, first of all, we're going to change the format to H.264. And I find this format is the best combination of like a quick render time a small file size and a good quality render and literally the the files come out to like somewhere between 5 to 10 megabytes on every intro and that takes like 30 seconds to upload to YouTube which is really good or maybe even less so yeah H.264 is definitely a great format and to, compared to QuickTime, QuickTime usually renders it, it takes a lot longer to render and also the file comes out to be a couple hundred megabytes. So we're going to check off include source XMP metadata and then we're going to click on format options. So um, yours is probably going to start out at VBR one pass um, under the bitrate settings but you're actually going to want to change that to CBR and under CBR for the bitrate you're going to set that as 8. Now for the profile you're going to want to put that at high and the level you're going to put that at 5.1 okay and we're almost done if you have audio in um, your intro which you probably should you're going to check off audio output and for the format options these are basically the uh, they default at the right settings but in case yours don't the codec is AAC the audio quality is high and the bitrate is 128 and now you can click OK for that so yeah guys that's basically uh, the tutorial on render settings in After Effects pretty quick tutorial and one last thing before you render you're going to want to hold down caps lock and you might already know this tip but basically what it does is it disables this preview which increases the render time by a lot so if I click render it's still going to render pretty slowly but that's not because of the render settings that's just because this is a really complicated uh, project with like over 15 layers so basically with under reddit with any render settings it's going to render slow um, but yeah guys that's the tutorial thanks for watching please like the video if you like the tutorial and comment feel free to comment if you want to request a tutorial thanks for watching